Titanium nitride is a binary alloy composed of titanium and nitrogen. This phase is often used in industrial settings to harden surfaces such as drill bits. It is also used as a non-toxic coating for medical implants like hip replacements. Titanium nitride has a rock salt crystal structure composed of two elements. This bundle structure is the same as NaCl crystals. This crystal structure can be visualized as two FCC structures of each element that are interspersed. We calculate the crystal structure to have an atomic packing, fa packing factor of 0.53. This relatively low EPF makes titanium nitride have low ductility because there is more space between atoms and more holes, making it harder for planes to move past each other and for the material to deform. On its own, titanium has a melting point of 1670 degrees Celsius. However, when it's combined with nitrogen, they can form a phase with a melting point of 3350 degrees Celsius. This allows the material to be useful to protect other materials that would melt in hot environments by producing a hard coating. Titanium nitride has covalent bonds with a strong ionic character of 43%. Its inner atomic potential curve is very steep, resulting in a very high modulus of elasticity and low coefficient of thermal expansion. The high energy of these bonds also explains why this phase has such high a melting point. The hardness of titanium nitride is increased by strengthening directional covalent bonds and decreasing the number of TITI metallic bonds. The newly created TIN bonds are stronger and have high energy. This high bond energy also explains the phase's chemical stability, oxidative resistance, good adhesion to substrate, high fracture toughness, and high hardness. Defects in titanium nitride can be useful depending on the application. Dislocations are responsible for fracture toughness of PVT coatings and they are able to impede the propagation of cracks. Point defects created by ion bombardment are the origin of high compressive stresses and sputter coatings deposited at low pressures, at least when increasing the intrinsic stresses. One way titanium nitride can be produced is through chemical vapor deposition. This is a process where the workpiece is coated in a titanium compound and heated in a nitrogen and hydrogen atmosphere to produce the TIN coating. The other method is by a form of physical vapor deposition called reactive sputtering. This is a process where nitrogen gas reacts with the surface of titanium by the use of plasma, resulting in a thin TIN layer.